We begin with breaking news. And that breaking news we're on is out of Nevada County tonight, where the search for two people has now come to an end after two bodies were found near a crashed car. It has been more than 10 days since anyone had heard from Juan Zavala and Jeanette Pantoja. Yeah, they had been on a day trip to Reno and then were never seen again. Tonight, crews found their SUV off of a steep area of Highway 20 near Poker Flat Road and two bodies were found near the wreckage. Let's go to case area three's Leanne Denier. She's been live at the scene for us, bringing us the latest. And uh, what have you heard now, Leanne? Well, just a few minutes ago, the first responders that were here on Highway 20 just left. So a lot of sort of happened within the last few minutes, but I wanna show you this. I wanna show you just how steep this embankment is. Um, it's a little difficult to, to see with the lighting right now, but it is quite steep. And the first responders that were here on scene told us that made this a, a bit challenging. We're told that the vehicle was found beyond the trees down this embankment and we were here as they were towing that vehicle up. I do believe we have some video of that that we can can show you at home, but certainly not the update anybody wanted to hear um, about the this missing persons investigation. So law enforcement has been able to share some information. They say they got a call earlier this evening uh, that someone had spotted the vehicle down this steep embankment and that's what brought uh, first responders out here to locate the vehicle to eventually identify the two individuals as Zavala and Pantoja and then get that vehicle towed away. That just happened about 10 minutes ago tops at this point. Again, we're along Highway 20 and it was just here that they towed the vehicle up this steep embankment through this brush area and then of course drove it off just a few minutes ago. So there's still a lot of questions and the, the authorities that were here just a short time ago said that they weren't able to answer those questions at this point. We do know that CHP is going to be investigating the actual traffic accident, crash, uh, but certainly more questions still from family members, from friends and loved ones and people who have been following this case over more than a week now. But in Nevada County, the vehicle and those two individuals have been found in Nevada County. Leanne Denier, KCRA 3 News.